This is again from the series that I was trying. Right? We'll see if we'll see if the, if the disc can, can be set up. Uh, it's from the series that I was so impressed with many years ago when it was in, in the seventh. And uh, it's a Bulerius by Bernardo de Utrera. And we'll see a, a look, some of that and some perhaps of her sister, the greatest cantaora, female singer, in living memory. But, uh, let's, see how, let's see how it goes. If we have... Can we run cut, uh, cut di disc one, first cut, disc nine, first, uh, first cut. Not, not that cut, P push the button for, uh, th this is a great camera on. Go, go to the one before that, if you can. It should be number one. I, I could be wrong, man. Change, change the, the cut. Do we go to work? Is that the only cut you can get on that? Okay. Uh, it'll be 50 50 if we, if, we, if we go to another cut. Good. Let's, let's do this if we can. As I said, this is this is Fernanda, the great the greatest female singer.
flamenco singing. Uh, I've heard her do that for seven or eight hours straight, just in that, so just doing so like, uh, things like. It's, uh, it's an acquired thing. You, you, my father had an early hi-fi record. Play, play, play the uh, and it was called, had, had flamenco song on it. It was called Music to Speed the Parting Guest. Uh, and it worked. Uh, people would listen to that for a while and say, you know, uh, So, I, so I'm, I'm not being silly. There are, there are singers who, who are beautiful and, and make beautiful sounds. And I have neglected them. Uh, there's a whole style of singing called Cante Bonito, pretty song, which, uh, which for many years I, uh, I neglected. I, I, and the greatest master of that was a man named Pepe Marchena. Uh, and I, when the great Flamenco Puro production was in New York, I, uh, I was, everybody was here. I, I was sitting next to the, the great guitarist Sabikas at dinner, and, and across was Pepe Abichuela, one of, the great, uh, one of the great guitarists of our time now. And uh, I made a disparaging remark about, uh, about Cante Bonito and Pepe Marchena, that sing so marbly stuff and, uh, and the, the guitarist Pepe Arbichuelo looked at me and said you know your problem and I said no what he said your ears are too small and your mouth is too big <laughs> and I actually I looked next to me Sabikas was next to me it wasn't a friend it was Sabikas we know each other and he and he just looked up and went, which is, which is to say that he agreed that I was foolish to have dismissed this great artist in the, in the, in the, in the 20s, in the 30s and 40s. He was an artist, and these flamencos that you're seeing here, they, they thought we were, just, we were just singing, but he's a real artist. He comes to town, he goes to Bullring, there's megaphones, everything. It's, it's a, he's an artist, and we are just us. Uh, but I steal opinions, that's how I... That's where I get this stuff, and so then, and the next night, because Flamenco Puro was in town in the 80s, what great production we had here. Uh, I was with Fernanda de Utrera, a woman we just saw, and I said to her, "You know, I used to think that Pepe Marchena was really just, you know, this, this stuff." Little did I realize that he was in fact a major artist and an important interpreter of flamenco. And she looked at me and said, until now, I thought you knew something about this art. <laughs> uh, yes. Okay, great. And, uh, and, and, and any further questions, uh, come and see me. And if anybody's writing it down, the, the artists that you would like to see on YouTube or uh, are for singing, the great, uh, great Chano Lobato, the phenomenal Miguel Poveda, who has just come up as a, as a, a from out of Barcelona, uh, Fernanda de Utrera, El Chocolate, the, the, who was singing for El, for Faruco the dancer, Agujetas, A G U J E T A S, uh, Manolo Caracol, we didn't see him. Uh, I mentioned the dancers uh, by, by the, that, that I uh, that I single out. Uh, Please look them up. They're all they're all on YouTube, and uh, and, and film doesn't matter anymore. Uh, anybody like the further questions? Uh, I guess I'm, my daughter tells me I'm at brookzern at gmail.com or uh, flamencoexperience.com. Thank you. Right. Okay. Thank you very much. Any questions, please come see me.